Hi guys! I'm gonna try and do a hill camp. I've never been much of a fan of hill camps because down south where I am, the countryside's so busy, um, it's hard to get away from people and I feel like in a tent on a hill it's like, hiya, look at me! So I bought my tarp and I'm gonna try and do something really stealthy. So we'll see how it goes. trying to find somewhere like anywhere I think oh that's a good little nook there's just so many brambles so the search continues I think I found a little place I've decided to do a plow point against this tree Tarp, so if you're gonna use a stick and put something over it like this luckily I've got some tenacious tape so we can fix that up it'll be fixed in a jiffy I can't get it straight luckily this is a 20 pound top Yeah, so make sure you cover the end of your stick with something or you could rip your tarp. Okay, that does the job. I ripped up my waterproofs as well, so I've used tenacious tape on these. I actually did that earlier and it's holding up really well. So yeah, day of ripping stuff. I definitely feel much less noticeable in a tarp than I do in a tent like I wouldn't put a tent here. I've got this new little mini tarp for the floor. Oh my god. Oh, it scared me. I just sat on a packet of crisps. <laughs> and then this is just going to protect my thermarest from the floor and it's going to reflect some heat back up for me as well. I wonder if I put it along that way instead. <laughs> still, still sliding around. Um, it's like being on a freaking slip and slide. if this is going to work you guys a bit too much of a hill I've just got visions of just sliding right out underneath the tarp in my sleeping bag so after all that I've come to the unfortunate decision that I have to move because it's too much of a hill and I'm just sliding around everywhere so yeah sun's going down soon as well such a beautiful sunset Current situation is I have nowhere to camp and the sun's going down. Right, I'm gonna try and get the tarp attached from up there and go across here. gone down 
put some form of shelter up. It's a bit of a weird one, a very low plough point. But you know what, it will do the job and I'm actually glad I had to move. I feel better here because it's really off the path. Like I had to go through a lot of brush and stuff to get here so I feel nice and safe. Welcome to the inside of my little tarp. Um, there were some brambles coming along the floor. I'm really hoping it's going to be safe for my thermorest. But hopefully with my mats and stuff, it'll be alright. Time to get some food on the go. I've got a bag bowl made by me and George. Also got some cheese and some garlic bread. I don't know how to keep that up to figure something out. Such a beautiful night. Moon's out and there's not the tiniest bit of wind. And usually on a hill it's pretty cold and windy, but it's so still and gorgeous. I'm loving it. Bag bowl done. Good camping food. Getting chilly now. Okay, right. I've got my Rab today. Rab 900 sleeping bag. So. I need to get that out to loft. I'm being naughty and not using the bag today. Can't be bothered. Bedtime drink. Just made a lovely decaf cappuccino a um, little bit of whiskey in that just for fun and I've got salted caramel dark chocolate too I'm coming in for the night as much as is possible to come in in the top Okay, I'm in bed now. Look what I can see. It's a nice view on that. Good night, moon. Good night, wild ones. Morning. It's about half five. Had the best night, honestly. I have been so cozy and warm. This sleeping bag is an absolute game changer. I've never been so warm. I, I didn't even get like one little chill, nothing. It's amazing. I'm so happy I got it. I had a lovely night. I woke up for a little bit around 2 a.m., and that's it. It's amazing. Trying to get up, I'm so cozy here. Stay here a bit. For today's breakfast, we've got. Cinnamon porridge and 
licorice latte. I like my porridge like cement. So don't want too much here. Yeah, that would do. Irish coffee. I've never had cinnamon porridge before. I tell you what actually it's a bit weird with Irish coffee. We don't have the two together. Too many flavours going on. All packed up. Goodbye, camping place. On the way out of here now. much more than I thought I would. It was so nice to have a view, you could see for miles and watch the world going around and I loved sleeping under a tarp as well, just having fresh air and being able to look up at the stars and the moon. It was gorgeous, amazing night. But yeah, really pleased. I'm off home now. Thank you so much for watching guys. If you like this video please like, please subscribe for lots of outdoorsy, wild camping, wild stuff and um, I will see you again soon. Take care guys, bye!